Welcome to Picture Healer Channel. This is Shi Tian. Today we want to talk about the monthly flying star chart for December 2020. The flying star monthly chart is based on the lunar calendar, especially the 24 solar turns on the calendar. So the actual day is from December 7th until January 5th, 2021. And here is the chart for December. In the center is number 7. Last month, the number in the center is 8. So we always go in order. The next month, the center will be number 6. And let's look at the combination chart. As usual, we have the yearly chart, the monthly chart, and the period chart. And you can see the yearly chart is exactly the same as the monthly chart this month. So there are only two numbers in each box. And it's similar in November's chart. But in November's chart, the center number is 8. So that month, the monthly chart is the same as the period 8 chart. Either way, the combination number in each sector will be the same. So if you set up your feng shui last month, it will be pretty much the same for this month. And you can keep the feng shui cures in the same place. The lucky areas are the same as last month, the center, west, and northwest. And if you're concerned about health, it's mostly related to number two and number five stars. And this month, the monthly star and the yearly stars are the same, so it intensifies the power. That's why I put south and east with green color for health because uh, south has number two and east has number five. And let's start with the center star, that's number seven. And the number seven star is related to young girl in the family. Each star has a related family member and the related person can be affected more by the power of that star. And the number seven star can either bring wealth, fame, or lawsuit, gossip, and fighting. And the seven and eight combination is a very auspicious combination. The number eight star generates number seven star. And that can bring happy relationship and good luck in money management, wealth, and fame. So we can place money enhancers in the center area. And in the West, the monthly star is number nine. And number nine is related to middle daughter. And it's also a festive star that can bring in all kinds of happy events. And number one is also a very auspicious star. So this combination can bring prosperity, wealth, health, and offspring luck. But because one is fire element, one is water element. So there can be some unexpected change or unexpected loss related to this direction. But generally, this is a very lucky direction this month. And the Northwest is also another very lucky direction. The number eight is the monthly star, and it's related to the young boy in the family. And number eight can bring all kinds of luck but on the downside, it can also make you too comfortable and become lazy. So the A and 9 combination can bring you wealth, career success, fame, and festive event. And this is a good place to set up money enhancers or set up important rooms. In the north, it's number 3 for the monthly star. The number three star is related to the oldest son in the family. The number three star is related to conflict and argument. And the number four star is related to intelligence and popularity. And this combination can bring unexpected events and the tendency for relationship trouble. And also watch out for illness related to liver, gallbladder, or the wood type of disease based on the Chinese medicine because both number three and four stars belong to the wood element. 
The North East has number one for monthly star, and the number one star is related to the middle sun. And this is an auspicious star related to intelligence and career luck. And the number two is an illness star and also an earth star. So based on five element theory, the number two star controls the number one water star. That's a conflicting combination. This one and two combination can bring illness and the imbalance of the male-female power or the disharmony in relationship, especially between mother, son, or husband and wife. And we can add metal objects here to reduce the number two illness star because metal can reduce earth. It can also balance the earth and the water. In the east, it's the number five star as the monthly star, and it's also the yearly star here. And the number five or the five yellow star is famous for all kinds of misfortune. The number five star generates number six star. So the six star actually reduces the power of the number five star. So this combination reduces the negative power of the number five star. And the five six combination also indicates wealth, luck, especially for physical type of career, such as police, military, or firefighter, because of the number six star. And uh, we can display metal objects here again, such as the wind chime or bronze bell or a metal clock, because metal can reduce earth and also avoid any construction here. The next direction is southeast and the monthly star is number six. The number six star is related to the father and authority. And both six and seven stars belong to the metal element. And this is a classic sword fight combination. That means there's a fighting energy and possible argument, legal trouble or accident. On the other side, it can also mean power, fame, and career advancement. And the feng shui cure for this area is the water element, such as the salt water cure. And that can balance the energy of number six and seven. The water can reduce the energy of metal, so you can reduce the number six and seven stars. In the south, there is a number two star as the monthly star and also the yearly star. And uh, number two is related to mother or wife and it's also related to illness. So this is the area we have to place metal objects to reduce the illness star. And that combination of number two and number three star is also a fighting combination. It's called the bullfight combination, similar to the south, east, the number six and seven stars. So it can indicate legal trouble, argument, fighting, health issue, even possible loss of a spouse. Besides adding metal objects for health, you can also add a fire element, such as a red carpet or lighting or candles to balance the number two and three bullfight combination. The last area is southwest. It's number four for monthly star and also the yearly star. And the number four is related to older daughter. And this is the star of intelligence and exam luck. If you want to study and pass certain exam and get in promotion, this is a place you can enhance. Another star here is the number five star and the number four wood star controls the number five earth star. So it's a controlling cycle and both are not tiny star in period eight. So the negative side is showing more. The number five star is a misfortune star. So this combination, we should be careful about your health, watch out for illness or accident, and place metal feng shui cures and avoid construction 
in the southwest this month. And here is the summary chart with suggested feng shui cures. In those green areas, we want to add metal objects such as wind chime, bronze bell, or metal clock to reduce the illness star of number two and number five. And in the south, we can also add a fire element, either the color of red or anything gives our light and fire. In the southeast, you can add water element, such as a salt water cure to balance the energy. And the three auspicious directions are the center, west, and northwest. It's the same as last month. You can set up important rooms here and set up money enhancers in those areas. So that's the monthly analysis for December 2020. And I cannot believe this is the last month for 2020. Many people are interested in the reading for the new year. And I set up the Yi Jing consultation or the Yi Jing readings on my website. And I can give you some advice based on the Chinese classic book of Yi Jing. There are 64 combinations. And it can give you some perspective of where you are and where you are going. If you're interested, you can check out more on my website, picturehealer.com, under consultation. I will put link in the description box below. I also have an Amazon page. You can find some feng shui cures and enhancers there. The link will be in the description box too. Thank you for watching my video and supporting my channel. Stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll talk to you in the next video.